Hello everybody! As all of you know, one of the most important things in our businesses are our employees. And in this video I want to talk with you about 7 different ways how you can find a virtual assistant. Uh, it's called VA for your eBay dropshipping business or for your e-commerce business at all. So I'm Leo Posin, I'm owner and CEO of PhotoDS and let's start with the first one. So the first one is Upwork.com. Upwork.com is a site of freelancers of many, many, many different niches and many, many different types of works. The good things with Upwork is that they have a time tracker and a screen recording uh, software. So when you work with someone from Upwork, it's very easy to give your uh, VA the option to work with you and the, to track the hours directly from Upwork. Also, all of the payments in this site are going to Upwork, which is very, very comfortable and very easy uh, to work on this way because it's very uh, automatic for you. When your uh, employee, when your uh, VA just put the hours in the site, once a week the money goes to him automatically. So it's great for us, it saves us a lot of time and we have here the screen recording feature. Some bad things about Upwork. The best things here are that all of the money must go from Upwork and Upwork takes very, very, very high fees for this. The fees are going from 275% from us, from the person who pay, to 5% uh, up to 20% which Upwork takes from the uh, freelancer, which means that it increases by around 25% the prices. So this is why the Upwork is not the cheapest site to find a virtual assistant. But still on this site we have tons of VAs. I think that this is the biggest site of uh, uh, virtual assistants and of freelancers at all from very, very different uh, places and different niches. But still it's more expensive. And from the other side we can see that the employee, that the virtual assistants are good. How we can know it? Because in Upwork they have like uh, you can see how much this virtual assistant already did uh, profits from Apple. So if someone did like ten thousand dollars and he have like he has like uh, ninety five percent of uh, positive feedbacks or something like this, so you can know that this uh, uh, person, this freelancer, is a very very high quality, and you want to work with someone like this. The next site called uh, Guru.com. Guru.com is a site which is very similar to Upwork. It's just much cheaper and has much less uh, freelancers. But you can search on both sites and check which of them you prefer. I personally work only with Upwork. Even if it's more expensive, it still saves me a lot of time. And this is why I'm using Apple. So this was the first two sites. Uh, they pretty similar but now we will go to some other types of sites the next option is online jobs ph this site is only for filipino uh, freelancers vas and the good thing with this site is that the prices here are very 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 cheap the reason for this that the prices are cheap is because the site uh, doesn't take any money from us for the payments. We pay not from the site, we pay directly to the freelancers. This way we need uh, to pay them directly by PayPal and the uh, minus here is that we need to purchase a time tracker uh, software like Time Clock Wizard or Hubstuff, something like this. So the uh, benefits of this site is that they have a lot of very very cheap uh, freelancers because they don't take any fees they have a lot of different freelancers who already worked with ebay and ebay dropshipping so you can find their very high quality people but you need to ch check their scores and feedbacks and reviews the problem with this site is that for the free subscription let's go to the pricing first for the free subscription, you can't really uh, check and contact the freelancers. So if someone, you can apply a job, but you can just see that people applied to your job and made offers. But you can't really check who uh, contacted you and you can't really contact this uh, person. So this way, actually, it's not really practical to work with this site uh, without paying them any subscription, while Upwork and the other site are free. On this side, the subscription, uh, the minimum subscription which 
can really work for you cost $70 per month $69 per month uh, sometimes it's worth it I know that a lot of big dropshippers like this site and work only with this site because they just purchase a subscription one time finding their uh, employees and then they just close the subscription on the site so you can work with this site you can work with Upwork Upwork is easier but cost more money for the long term for the sorry for the sh for the uh, short term but for the long term this uh, site the online jobs is much better because you pay just one time to find a freelancer so here it's better for long term upwork is better for a short term so this is the first three sites online job upwork and guru.com now we'll go to some other ways to find virtual assistants the first way is just go to facebook Go to any uh, uh, dropshipping group, for example, uh, you can go to the group of AutoDS and just upload here a post about, hey, please, uh, I'm searching for VA, any VA available here. Now, this method is very interesting because on this method you can find people who already worked for other people. Uh, you, maybe these people already know strategies which you don't know. I saw a lot of freelancers, a lot of VAs who know a lot about dropshipping and they have really interesting strategies and uh, ways of work so in many cases this way may be the best way because first of all it's free uh, the second thing is that these people will be very experienced so if you upload a job in AutoDS it's a very high chance that this VA already worked with AutoDS and then you can uh, just contact them and it will be much easier to start the next thing is uh, sites not sites or uh, groups in facebook like uh, this one virtual assistant network philippines this option is also a free option but it's a bit di dangerous because you don't really know the feedbacks you don't really know the experience of the people who you will find here so if you go from this way you just need to uh, make a very long interview and to ask your virtual assistant a lot of questions so this way you can really know that when you work with someone with this VA, he will be really uh, suitable for your needs. Otherwise, if you don't ask him a questions and you don't do any trial and very long interview, you can really have uh, problems in your business because you don't know who uh, will come from this group. From groups like AutoDS, for example, you know that the person already worked for someone else in AutoDS. You can ask me, you can ask the other guy and you can check uh, how was this uh, virtual assistant. So this was about the Facebook group. So we had two types of Facebook groups, one uh, of companies or dropshipping tools. One uh, actually it can be also just general groups like I don't know eBay dropshipping mastermind for example. You can go to this group. This group is huge. So we can just go to this group and upload a post there and there are also many 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 different other big groups so you can just use them and you be, can be sure that people there are already doing dropshipping and just make an interview and check them so one is general dropshipping group the second one is uh, virtual assistant groups we have three different sites also like guru upwork and uh, online jobs ph the next option of how to is a site which called talent.hubstuff talent.hubstuff.com Hubstuff is a program where you can track your uh, the time of your employees so what Hubstuff did they just added an option to find virtual assistant here it's very very cheap here actually I think it's almost uh, I, th I think it's free actually this site I never used it but I just checked it and I saw that you have here a lot of freelancers you can write, just write here eBay dropshipping and you will find many very cheap and very experienced uh, uh, eBay uh, virtual assistants you can see here for three dollars per hour another one two dollars it's amazing usually prices for a virtual assistant will be between two dollars and five dollars so just search for something in uh, these uh, prices ranges the next option uh, and this is option number seven and this one actually I don't like personally because I like when um, my virtual assistant the people who work with me are working with me and not with someone else so the option is virtual assistant training companies 
There are third party companies who ju just taking a lot of virtual assistant, they put them in the office or they are doing a remote uh, training, they teach them and then you can just go to these companies and ask for a virtual assistant. I don't like this option because one thing is that the, these people, this virtual assistant are working for this company, they don't really work for you. So first of all the prices are higher and the second thing is that they will work on the ways that the company teach them. So you, you want to teach your virtual assistant for your methods because the methods which these companies usually uh, teach, I don't say that all of these companies but most of them are very generic and not really working anymore. It's like old methods which j they just teach them in the past and then this virtual assistant like always working with these ways. I prefer uh, and I suggest you to learn how to teach the virtual assistant and I will also create an, another videos about this and then just work with them uh, directly. I hope that you like this video. This was my seven tips about how to find virtual assistant. Write in the comments uh, if you like this video, if you already have virtual assistant and if you uh, find it with one of these ways or do you have any other way. And please subscribe to our YouTube channel to be updated with the next videos. See you on the next videos. Bye bye.